Okay, I haven't made it out on the water yet, but my buddy Chuck did. He's got the first fish. First fish in what? Five minutes? Five minutes. It's gonna be a good day. And that right there is why we come up here. Going. And just like that, my friends. Got a double? This one's a bruiser. A good one. I'm letting a good one go right now, 17 inches. Nice. Sweet. Man, this is. Come here, baby. Oh, yeah. This one's been eating too many Twinkies. If I can get her to settle down for a second. Well, I was going to show her to you, but she gone. It's a beautiful day on the water. Even better with good friends. And there he goes. That rod's bent pretty good. Yeah, he says. <laughs> They're buying, buying lures anyway to come fish for the monster. Right. Everybody likes checking. Fish. Like this one? Yeah, like that one. Easy, girl. Yeah. This one's got some shoulders. It must be up on that delta feeding. Yeah. That's where I keep catching them is right in that one spot. Awesome. Come on up. There's plenty of room, man. Oh, well, I'll ease over here onto these cattails. Have at her, man. Uh, 
Yeah, she's a good one. Oh, oh, oh. Boy, that looks like Schwarzenegger. Hey, everybody. Thanks a lot for coming with me fishing. We had a great time. As you can see, it's raining again today. Cloudy and foggy and rainy. There's a brief... There's a brief... Ooh, hey, there's a herd of mule deer over there. If I see that, uh, if I see that four by four, before I'm done filming, I'll turn the camera and let you guys see them. I don't see them just yet. But, um, anyway, so it's foggy and rainy today. There's a brief intermittence between the rain showers, so I thought I'd do this this exit video. We had a lot of fun yesterday fishing. Um, this last week, it's been raining like two or three days. Um, and you know winter's coming so I need to I needed to get some stuff done in my house before um, we got a pretty big snowstorm coming tonight I believe we'll see um, but I had to fix my water heater and I had to fix my hydronic heating system I had a few things I had to do to that and I had to get some more material we did locate some 4x4s and some more 4x6s for the braces that are straight I know a guy that's got some 8x8s that he milled a long time ago out of some pretty big logs. They've been sitting around for about three years, and they're straight, so they've moved however they're going to move, and um, which is great. He milled them. They didn't really move after he milled them, so I think we'll be able to use those. And so I won't have to go buy some run-of-the-mill 4x4s from the lumber yard. Um, so at least half my girts will be, will be roughs on pine, which is cool. Um, and I located another post, and I just checked on my 20-foot 8x8 top plates. And I didn't even want to pull the covers off those, <laughs> but they actually look pretty good. I think they're pretty straight, so I think we'll be able to use them. Um, so once we get through this, I don't really mind working in the snow, so I mean, if, it, if I can get a day where it's actually not physically raining on me, um, or we'll just maybe the snowstorm will happen tomorrow and we can shovel everything off and get working again. But in any event, I've got all my little things I kind of had to get done, done. And um, we're going to start on bent number three um, this week and uh, get rolling again. So once again, I hope you enjoyed the fishing trip. You know, I sure had a lot of fun. It's a beautiful spot up in the northern Black Hills. Um, and it's always a great time fishing there in October. Um, lots of nice quality size rainbow trout and you know they're hungry. They got the feed bag on so it's a lot of you know 30, 40 fish days so we have a great time doing that. So I, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the scenery. Um, showed you a little another little side to myself. Um, I do enjoy fly fishing. I haven't been able to do it at all this year. Th that was the first time I've went. Um, so I was, I was glad I got to go. Um, but anyways, we'll see you guys on the next one and, uh, we'll get cranking on this timber frame again. Oh yeah, I forgot. Um, I was going to show you that mule deer, but I don't see him. He must still be bedded down and just see all of his girlfriends. Well, maybe another day. <laughs>